something that would be good for women for self-defense. Well, that's what we're here to promote. Mm -hmm. Because many times women are attacked or they come under attack in shopping centers, um, walking at night. Yes, ma'am. And the person, will, yeah, so you have to have a response. Yes, ma'am. Okay, that was the first one. And what was the second one? So you have women in there too. What was, show me the second one and what's the name for that? Show me what Nevar is. That's number two, eh? Yes, so, ma'am. And when you say Kim, what does that mean? Kia means exerting chi or internal energy. Okay, so they have to know what it means. Yes, ma'am. So you're not just doing something. No, you're not just going through the motions. You're actually having knowledge. I have them to uh, bring a tablet with them, five-subject tablet, and I give them terminology from my head that I've learned over the years. So you've been doing this a long time. Yes, ma'am. And you've taught forty-five years. And taught many classes with many people. Yes, ma'am. Which do you find easiest to teach, uh, the young people or the adults? It doesn't matter. Uh, if you're going to come in, and you, and you're going to comply, you'll be a good student. But if, you know, if you're not going to be a good student, you'll quit. Now let's tell us talk about a little bit about that belt that's around the waist. It, nobody's allowed to touch it. Is that correct? That's right. But them. So if someone starts touching it, what do they do? If they reach for it, they're going to draw back a nub. Oh. That's their <laughs> lifeline. The OB is considered as the lifeline. It's never touched. The OB around, around the waist? Yes, ma'am. And it's sacred? Yes, it is. Well, why, why is it two colors? Well, for them, uh, the, the red represents their bloodline, and the uh, black in the middle is the power that they gain from the earth. Okay, come here a minute. Stay where you are. And so if, if I would reach to touch that, what would you do? Block you. Ah, don't block me. <laughs> he said he's on this side and you're on that side, so he would take your mic and push it up there. Right. So that nobody. That's the block that he just gave. Right. Okay, and what is that called? Outward middle block. A what? We're in the middle block. At the middle block. That nobody touches that. Does it? And what does it mean? The red means the blood, bloodline, and the black means power. Okay. What is the bloodline? The bloodline is like our life. Oh, that's your life. Okay. So that's why. So that's why. At all times, with that bloodline, he protects his heart. Yes. Okay. So everything has meaning. Now tell me, does this ha does this say a word? Right, I touched that. <laughs> no, it's okay. It's okay. Did I, did, did that, does that have a meaning? A word? Those are those tell words? Them, tell them what the it's my name, Japanese. Okay, turn around there so they can see it. <laughs> it's your name in Japanese. You know the letters. You know the letters in it. No, but I know what it means. Okay. And what, t touch the other thing, the symbol. The symbol is the foundation. Okay, what, does that have a meaning? It represents the foundation that we earned. Foundation that you earned, okay. So now you've gone from black to red. And what's your next color? Black Another, belt. A black belt. And, wh and what would be around your waist? A black belt, which means power. Oh, okay. Well, thank you very much for sharing that. Us. And you're going to give us another demonstration, aren't you? Okay. All right, Senpai, give me uh, the patty. We're going to demonstrate uh, some, some punches and kicks. I want you to hold the kicking bag while I hold the punching bag. Yelani. All right, you all line up this way. This way. Okay. Get up with Bobby Seven. Stand up beside your brothers. Your line, turn this way. So good out. So did. Red. Can't stop it. Okay. All right. Come to touch it. Right stance. Right leg back. Come on, come on. Get with the program. Get with the program. Here we go. Here we go. Elbow, back fist. Reverse punch. Elbow, back fist, reverse punch. Wakimi. Heights. 
elbow, back fist, reverse punch. Get with the program. Come on. Elbow, back fist, reverse punch. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Move faster. Come on. Come on. Let's go again. Come on. Come on. Don't think about it. You don't think about it. Get back. Get back. Get back. Get back. So good at So they step to the side. Step by. Get on. Step over there. Step over there. Line up over there. Move up. Move. Move. Get on deck. So good at So they Ray. Kill Shadachi Schmidt. Come to touch it. Ice. Elbow strike. Ice. Back fist. Ice. Front kick. Come on. Come on. Ice. Come here. Ice. Come on. Ice. Okay. Yummy. Now we're going to show you some basic kicks. I'm going to show you some basic kicks. Line up. Line up. Line up, hurry up. Commit the dachi. Let's go. Line up. Going down the line. Front kick. Front kick. Roundhouse kick. Side kick. What kimmy? Combinate. Combinate. Switch them sides. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Front kick. Come on. Come on. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Come on. Get back. Get back. Get back. Get back. Give it to me. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, come on. Let's go. Two punches. Let's go. And move faster. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Get back. Get back. Get back. Get back. Come on. 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 Get back. Get back. Get back. Get back. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Good. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Wake up. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Front kick. Come on. Roundhouse kick. Come on. Side kick. Come on. Two punches. All right. Come on. Front kick. Come on. Come on. There you go. There you go. There you go. Yes, ma'am. A little bit so the audience will have a clear understanding of what they see happening okay. right here. Now, when you kick, you're only supposed to bring your feet so high, right? Well, yeah. main objective is that you want to strike uh, major points on the body when you kick. Uh, walk with me. The areas that you want, to, you want to damage when you kick are from this area to this area right here. Anything from here, someone can grab your foot. But the most effective areas that you want to kick are like this area right here, this area right, right there. Well, you got to be fast. Yes, it takes a lot of years to get to gain speed. So speed, speed is evidently very. Well, you just don't want to be. Uh, you don't want to utilize speed. You want to utilize speed and power. Okay. So speed and power has. That's the essence of it. Yes, ma'am. It's not strength, is it? Yes, it is. Okay, so you, when you kick. You're looking at the abdomen. You want to kick them in the stomach. You, yes, the abdomen area right here and above. This area right here. You want to focus on from here, from, from the top of the OB to this area right here. And what is that going to do to the person to the victim? It's going it's to, it's, it's actually, it's, it's going to stop them. It's going to knock the wind out of them. Because it's hitting on the lungs. Well, the lungs are located back here. But, it's gonna, but the shock that it gets when he bends over, it's going to bring friction to the lungs, and it's going to be gasping for air. And by then, you've used lots of multiple, te multiple techniques to take him down, where you can cut off, cut off his breathing altogether. Is that what the Marines teach? No, this is the martial arts. <laughs> so that's what martial arts Right. Teach. See, I don't teach a watered-down martial arts. I teach a combative martial arts. Here you are, a single woman. You've been violated. What do you do? Do you freak out? Or do you use your head? Or you, or do you run? Well, you don't look like the type that'll run. 
you stand there in battle and, 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 and you deal with it. But when I, when I teach you the vital points, where to hit, where to strike, you can take it from there, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. So, so that's, that's the black belt. That's step three. No, you, you, you learn from white belt up. You learn, this, you learn this from white belt up. Okay, and, 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 and so and what with, she... With that, you asked about strength. Uh -huh. As he explaining to you, and you see our students, they stayed in a form. They, they didn't, didn't move. move. Did. That's strength in the body. And the, the actual strength is like this, and we stay there for a while to uh, promote our strength in our legs. And it comes from our legs on up, strengthening the body. So that's a you practice that. Yeah, they're, they're it just doesn't come natural. You, you, it comes through practicing and being conscious right. of it. Yes, ma'am. Constant practice. They are so, very obedient and disciplined to the form of the martial arts where we are practicing whenever so, we're so, so there not to move. So that stance? That stance right there is strengthening their body. Yes. If yes. don't move. That's no. where the strengthening comes from, besides the kicking, constantly kicking and punching. It, it's it's um, boxing too, right? No, ma'am. Well, the form that they have shown, have shown you, it promotes the, uh, the, the punch, the block and then the punch. And sometimes we're standing and we're so, blocking so, several times. So when the hand is up, like the stance here, that's the block. That's the block. That's to keep the so up. I should come up and touch her anywhere, she's immediately gonna block me. I shouldn't even be able to touch her. Just as I come toward her, she's blocking. So what, so you stand, you get in the if attack, you get in that stance mo mode. Yes, ma'am. Immediately. Yes. So you got to be thinking all the time about what's what's going to come next. Yes, ma'am. Okay. I want to thank you so much for sharing with us. Thank you. And for coming to let us know martial arts because it's growing a lot. Yes, it is. In Charlotte. Yes, it and is. And it has many, many different names, doesn't yes, it? Is. And many different. So do you ever participate in competitions with other martial arts no ma'am professional no ma'am some people want a, a lot this is combative this, uh, this combat is combative martial arts we do not um, compete but the other kinds uh, compete well, i think this had something at a great coast center one time well that, that's watered down that's not the true martial right arts. I, if you compete you can't fight in the street then you're doing it for another reason i don't know what the reason they're doing it for <laughs> but this is, this is combat self-defense so okay, it's not a comp it's not a, where you go and you participate in competition with other people who are doing the same thing. No, ma'am. It's just for you and it's sacred, so yes. you don't share it. Yes. I want to thank you for being with us on Views with Joyce. Why they are an audience too. I want to thank you for being with us. All right. Go ahead.